Hi, Dan. Hey, Joe. <sighs> home from your vacation? Yeah, we got home Wednesday. So. So it was, it was fun. It was fun. It was, it's a lot. We were three boys under the age of five, five years and under. So. Oh, that sounds rambunctious. Yeah, we had a big cabin with a pool and, you know, stuff like that. So there were, you know, we would leave and go do an activity in the town. You know, it's kind of your like typical, typical mountainy tourist trap sort of place, but it's really awesome. Um, so, um, one, one little monitor. Um, Having fun is the most important thing, right? Yeah, but, we, like, but yeah, we were able to like go do something during the day, and then we had plenty of activities for the boys to do, my son and my two nephews to do whenever we got back. Um, so, yeah, it made, uh, it made for a lot of fun. <sighs> Harry and Bishop, huh? Yep. Well, that'll be fun for us. Oh, well, we'll see. I suppose I haven't been doing too well with the Thanos teams I've been trying. So this came up with this this afternoon. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What am I missing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, it looks like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, that Well, that is an interesting combination. Um, doesn't really help with uh, Harry and Bishop, though. But we were both unthemed. <laughs> yeah, no, I was actually looking at High Evolutionary 2, and I remember, oh yeah, I can't have two primes. <laughs> right, yes. And I like Destroyer a lot on Thanos, but... Um... You know, I, I wanted to try high Evo. I tried it a few weeks, and I just I cannot remember to put tokens on them for the life of me. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if I do better with it in person or what, but at least what what about here in World Twenty? I just to put tokens on who? On on the destroyer. I oh, just... the destroyer. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. Like I've even tried blowing it up to like be like three by three on the sideline to remind me and I still just right. even with it staring at me. Right. Oof. Well I got a perfectly average seven for map roll. Okay. Oh. I got a slightly below average six. Alright, well I have absolutely no idea what to do now. Um, um but I guess We'll go to the uh, workshop because you don't have a molecule man. I do not. Do you want the elevated or the um, open? I'll take the open side. Let me 
The high Evo at low points, right? Yeah, at 20. Yeah, yeah. Okay, this one to. And I don't have an animal themed team, so. <laughs> I mean, I think Thanos has everything except that keyword. Uh, scientist is the other. Yeah, I, I am a little surprised he doesn't have scientist. You know, that right. It's a little weird. He doesn't have that one. And yeah, no Molecule Man, but I mean, I don't know. I keep running into X-Men teams where I don't get my, where it doesn't matter to have him anyway, or Reed Richards, so. Right. You know, I thought I'd try something else. Yeah, I thought Bishop and Harry might be a good combo. Right, 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 right. <laughs> I'm gonna place my object over here if that's okay. Yeah, no, that's fine. Channel 6 news camera? Oh, my light? Uh, no, it's actually just a picture <laughs> of one of the old rock objects. I don't know how I ended up with that as my light, but <laughs> it's just kind of my favorite light to use for some reason. Yeah, that's, that's fine. My, the picture I put in mind was the uh, rock rule book that they used as a light object. Which I always thought should have been a heavy, not a light, but... Yeah. Alright. Okay. So I guess we're basically ready. Else. You mind if I swap now or Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, alright, I'm just gonna swap Xavier for Phoenix. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, I'll let them know we're ready. No, I already typed oh, it in. Okay, cool. Yes. I was doing some counting. Uh, yeah. It's a little surprise you changed. I mean, the, uh, the Spider Family Thanos team is really good. Uh, it doesn't have leadership, is my issue. Mm. True. But... There's times I would like to take four regular actions, and I can't. It's true. That is another advantage to Haivo with uh it there. Yeah, I was trying to find somebody that shared a keyword with Thanos with leadership and I really didn't like any of the options other than Captain Marvel that I could find. Right. It feels like enough other people. <laughs> and I don't know. Uh just didn't like any of the other teams I built up from that, so. Right, right. <laughs> but. Yeah. And yeah, that is another advantage there. That's interesting. Well, I've got Let's an idea of what I want to do. Okay. So, I guess we'll see if it works out. Hello, friends. Hi. Hey. 
are you judging tonight, as or is, is yeah, it... I got I got roped into judging because BZ no shit. And luckily, I don't do anything on most Fridays. Oh, thank you for stepping in. Yeah, <laughs> it's no problem. They asked if I wanted to play. I turned that down. I gotta prep for a tournament tomorrow. A local tournament thing? Uh, I'm so it's not for Hero Clicks. I'm going to play Flesh and Blood. I'm playing in a 5K tomorrow. Ooh. How is, how is that game? Uh, so I had absolutely zero interest in playing it. Then my friend finally got me to break down, and now I hate him because now I'm spending money on it. <laughs> Uh, Dan, is that the Tri Sentinel on your sideline? That's a Sentinel, the X Men Sentinel. Okay. Okay. I just I just started using that picture as the Sentinel, and I just haven't stopped. <laughs> it's definitely a Tri Sentinel. I probably should, but I just don't like the idea of a Tri Sentinel. Single base Tri Sentinel, for what it's worth, too. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I haven't played. I, I've just seen box openings for Flesh and Blood, and it looks semi interesting, but I really don't want to get roped into another game. It's either. a very interesting game. It is, yeah. it can be very expensive. Yeah, I bought a, no. uh, I bought a pack of it off of Amazon because somebody said that there was like a five thousand dollar card or something in there, crazy. And I was like, well, yeah, I'll spend ten dollars for that. So my buddy got top eight at the calling in Indianapolis this past weekend, um, which was like a five hundred plus person tournament. Um, oh, wow! The prize pack, the prize card that you get um, is a sealed pack. Um, and you open it, it has a gold cold foil, which is the highest rarity of cards you can get. You can only get it from when it, like, placing well in tournaments. Uh, he sold the sealed pack for three grand. Wow. wow. Do you know what that's, was in it? That's... Like, was there, like... I, I don't think he actually asked or stayed around to, to watch it get opened. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because there could be, um, like, just $5 in there, right? <laughs> It could be a lot lower than three grand, but yeah, <laughs> but those were guaranteed like high money cards. Um, the winner of that event got seven thousand dollars in cash and a card that was valued at roughly close to twenty grand. Wow. Yeah, I'm playing the wrong game. <laughs> <laughs> that is what everybody has said that I've told them that. <laughs> But it's kind of like a bubble, right? Like if I wanted to play for big money, right? I would have just started. I would have. I would play Magic, right? Right. If the, I wanted to play the game my leisure game cool. for as a job, I would. <laughs> I would play here. I would play Magic. Yeah. The, Even though I've the never mechanics played, of the game I haven't played Magic in over twenty years. Yeah. I started playing Arena during the pandemic. I mean, and it just you know just. I haven't really put just you know bought some some of this a little bit of money not much I mean just just for fun it scratches the itch because I used to play that like twenty years ago mm -hmm. just a little bit of arena is fun but so uh, the way the way flesh and blood was explained to me and it's the best way that I can describe it is in magic you have a card that does what it does like what it says it can do. In Flesh and Blood, your four-card hand, every card in your hand can be used three different ways. Mm. It can be used uh, for what it like what the effect of the card does. It can be used to block damage, or it can be used as a resource to pay for other cards. Mm, that sounds a little like the old Star Wars CCG. Kind of, mm. yeah. And then you have you have a hero. Your hero tells you what cards you get to pack plus the generic cards. And then you have equipment, uh, equipment loadouts. So you have a headpiece, a chest piece, gloves, boots, a weapon, maybe a shield. I think we're, uh, I think we're ready now. Did, are they finally good there? 
Okay. Yeah, because uh, Brandon you guys... was supposed to be in room five, and he's not. Yeah, because BZ's not. Uh, BZ's not here, and Brad can't play right now. So table one, I think, ended up getting a buy. But you guys are good to start. Okay. All right. Thanks. All right. Good all luck. Right. Good luck, Dan. All right. So, all right. Uh, you've done your beginning of turn stuff. I don't think I have anything yep. at the beginning of turn. So let's roll for gems with T Daddy. Uh, one. So let's just pick up phasing space, and then we need to go there. So we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, picking up the soul gem or power gem, I should say, power gem, and yes. equipping it. Mm -hmm. And then let's move high Evo down to here. And then we'll double perplex up chip speed. And we'll mm -hmm. sidestep chip to here, carrying everybody. And then mm -hmm. we will go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Carrying everybody. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And again, I have no real idea if this is the right idea, right thing to do, but we're doing it. At any rate. I think you want to sell my power, Jim. <clears throat> that, I, yeah, that is, that is accurate statement. <laughs> um, that one is accurate. Um, so, um, we'll do there. And then we will generate the pog. And the pog will go one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, sorry, we'll just go one, two, three, four, five, six. Side step. That keeps me within six of chip, I think, right? Um, yeah, six. And then so. Yeah, so. Um, boop. Boop. Picking up the old <laughs> power gem. And uh, let's do some smoke cloud with Molecule Man. Mm -hmm. uh, put one underneath there. One underneath there. And yeah. one underneath yeah. there. Um, actually, uh, if, 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 uh, no, I can't do that. All right, we're just going to do it there. Um, you can put three or four of them then. You haven't done anything. Yeah, know. I want to put yeah. high evo. High, playing high evo was the whole reason oh. I did that. Oh, that, yeah. That's fine. Because I mean, put the putting, pog there. The defend yeah, next to yeah, Thanos. Pog, yeah. yeah, no, that's fine. Yeah, no problem. Okay. No. And then there. Not no big deal. And then there. And then there uh one two three four five six and then roll to convert hey that's not bad i'll take it bop bop um that is me and he's holding the power gym all right, let's roll for Thanos. All right, so I get two gems. Um, all right, so let's go with... Go with mind and I 
Do mind and time. Okay. Alright. Um Phoenix. Alright, so let's Let's try and mind control. Okay, Thanos and Bass, got it. Alright, so. Eighteen. Uh, on eighteens. That is a huge miss. Um, uh, let's prob it with Santa. Okay, hang on. Yeah. Yeah, you get to. Uh, you get the. I didn't see your roll come in, but. Oh, it's it was a three. Okay. Uh, you may use uh, prob again, I guess. Oh no, two means you get to use it. I don't know. I've never played Faust before. It's bad of me. Um, I think two means I just it has normal effect. It's yeah, just normal remember, effect. Right. Yeah, got it. So yeah, you, yeah. you may prob it. No, see now your your two hasn't come up for me. So okay, let me let me exit and join back in real quick. <clears throat> I'm having just a skosh of. I'll do the same thing. Well. well. Okay, I see your three, but I, I definitely rolled a two. I'm not gonna. It didn't go. It didn't. It, okay. didn't, lo it didn't load up, so I'm not gonna like try to re-roll it and, or something. So. Okay. All right, that's fine. Two just lets me. All right. Anyway, um, so eighteen that will hit Thanos. Um, and yeah, that hits. Uh, it potentially hits Faust too, but I need to roll his super senses. Yeah. Uh, super senses. No, it does hit Faust as well. So that was okay. Cool. All right. So Faust is gonna try and punch Molecule Man. Okay. Needs uh, an eight. Yep. That'll hit potentially. I, I will uh, prob it with uh, Chip. Um. Okay. I will roll for Faust. Yeah. That's that's fun. Uh, yeah, no effect. Wow. And it takes damage on my own Faust. Yeah. That's um, sorry. sorry, Dan. That's all right. That's okay. Uh, so he does three, uh, right? Yeah. So yeah. that is a bye-bye molecule man. Oh, no, he does two. Sorry, not three. Okay, so that's a last click. Oh, and we haven't gone to after resolutions yet. Yep. All right, and I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna move Faust. Uh, I'm gonna try and break Faust away. Okay. Um, I'm gonna prob that with Faust. Okay. Oh, that's fine. Okay, um, and now I am going to have Thanos try and punch Faust. Okay, uh, 13 on 18. Yours. Yeah. That'll hit. Potentially. Super senses? Nope. Uh, okay. So that should kill your Faust. Yeah, and it puts Chip on last click, or second click. Okay. That went fairly well. All right. Um, so let's have Thanos um, dual target Thanos and Molecule Man. Okay. Attack. Um, yeah, that hits 18s. Okay. So, you yeah, um, three damage? Three damage. Um, let's just, I shouldn't have targeted Thanos. Um, I'll deal all of it to Molecule Man. Right. All right. That's in action. All right. <laughs> 
Phoenix. Uh, did I not say Phoenix? No, I didn't say Phoenix on my build because it. Uh, she, uh, she does have colossal endeavor, so she can't attack anybody. Um, Bishop is going to use phasing teleport. Um. And he's gonna go to here okay. and generate shard. Okay. Oh, usually I'm better at saving the things I'm gonna generate once. So it's six range and running shot. And three damage. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna move her back. Here. All right. Um, reactions. I don't have anything else free. Um, so yeah, that's your go. Okay. So let's go ahead and roll. Um, roll leadership with uh, high Evo. Rolling gems. Um. Ooh. So let's do um. Mind. Um, time and um, I'm looking. Um, I don't need power, mind and time for sure. And um, let's do. Uh, let's just do space. Um, okay. So, you, uh, you left me some characters within five squares of myself. I did leave a character within five squares. Two of them, actually. Mm -hmm. Um... So let's go ahead and we got to roll willpower as well. Mm -hmm. All right. So, um, energy shield deflection and toughness. So I am currently 14 for five. She does not have any reducer, right? Um, she's, oh, right. 45. Uh, I don't think so. Let me double check. Yeah. She's just got, oh, that's still my favorite. <laughs> It looks like she's got uh, ESD. Right. So, um, and then he doesn't, Her uh, Bishop doesn't have toughness or stealth at any point. Um, so we'll deal one to there and then um, one. Uh, we got four, so we'll deal three. Um, ship, so one. We got five total. One there. That leaves me four. One, two. And then I may not be able to kill Bishop this turn, but we'll try. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, yeah. He can do it. All right. So, um... Thoughts. Here we go. All right. Uh, Thanos. Power action. Dual target. Bishop. Phoenix. Numbers. Got it. Yep. Uh, so you are you gonna prob it with Thanos? Um. 
I mean, 13, 14 attack. You're not going to miss. No, I'm going to. No. Okay. So we'll deal one to Blue Phoenix in the end. That leaves me with yep. four. So we'll deal that to Bishop. And that sure. should put him on click four. Yep, it does. Math is hard today. Oh, he oh he has toughness. It's ESD toughness. So. Right, so I had four. four leftover damage, so he takes okay. three, so that puts him on four. Yeah, it's four. Okay. Uh, yes, math is very math is very hard. Barbie was correct. Um, so I'm going to have to use my last two, one, two, three, four, five. Um, so let's just go. Um, it's going to be, he's on click four. So he'll be in 18, 19 through the, and it's not going to get any better. So sidestep one, two, three, four, five. So it's not going to get any better there. So, uh, we need this one to stick. So we'll go high Evo. We'll double perplex up his attack. And uh, high evolutionary. Yeah, he just has two, so he'll take one, putting him onto five. And then we'll have to hit one more relatively big shot. Um, but we can always try to do that too. So, all right, that's the order we'll do it in. Um, high Evo, 13 attack on a 19 on Bishop. That is a hit. Um, let's prob that with Thanos. Okay. All right, that is uh, more, <laughs> more of a hit. hit. <laughs> okay. So that puts him uh, at five. Oh, wait. So, so, so. All right, so I will use my one, two, three, four. Um, I will use my space gem to go here. One, two, three, four, five. Carrying high Evo to there. Um, and then we'll dual target mind control Thanos and Bishop. Yep. <laughs> Um, 14 and a 5, that will hit Bishop yeah. and Thanos. Sure will. You do have senses on Thanos. Yes, thank you for reminding me. Nope. Okay, so we're going to get this part out of the way. Um, we're going to 1, 2, 3, move Bishop to here. Um, nice. And then uh, one, two, three. He'll just attempt to shoot Thanos, I guess. Uh, nine and a yeah. nine is a nope. He does sure. he doesn't ignore hindering, right? Uh, no, he doesn't. All right, okay. so that is one miss. Uh, so that was hits. So Thanos was my third hit of the turn. So. Mm -hmm. Um, Thanos punching Harry. Um, yeah, Thanos uh, punching real Harry. Quick, Bishop wouldn't have been able to attack Thanos because they're both friendly to each other. Oh well, all right. There's no attack with Thanos or Bishop with Bishop. No attack with Bishop. Just whatever. Mm -hmm. Um, Thanos punching H Dog. Yep, that hits. And I think it'll be two paths Harry. of toughness, right? Yeah. Yeah. So Harry will go to click three. Okay. Um, and then all right, I think that's it. Um sidestep with chip. Um use my third costed action to punch um Bishop ten on a sixteen. Yeah, that hits. Um, wait for the third hit. I wanted to uh, generate a sentinel. That's fine. Yeah. 
Um, yeah, that was on the mind. Con- that was on the mind control. Con- yeah, the mind control is the third one after resolutions. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Okay. All right. So Bishop is dead. Yeah, and that KO shard, correct? Um, let me double check. Why do I keep... Oh, sorry, man. I'm usually not this bad. Yeah, well, at the resolution of any action, if no friendly oh. character named Bishop is on the map, KO Shard. Yep. Okay. Um, All right. So, I played that poorly. So let's go the ahead. Next time. Sidestep to here, and then let's go ahead and autonomously KO your power gem while we're thinking of it. Um, And then that leaves us with a trouble... Maker to make. Mm-hmm. Uh, and a fourth action to use. Um, Sentinel is three clicks long. Um, one, two, three, four. Um, but it goes down pretty poorly. Um, Alright, so let's just go ahead and make uh, Lex here. Make sure that Lex has the range. Um, one, two, three, four. If we make Lex here, one, two, three, four. We'll go ahead and just shoot Sentinel. Um, Eleven for three on uh, numbers. Sentinel is seventeen. So that'll tag him for one. Um, actually, isn't that your... F- uh, the auto- um, this, this, guy is, that I- this guy is autonomous. Oh, right, but um, you attacked with... Um, didn't uh, High Evolutionary attack? Yeah, Where Thanos attack, Chip attack, High Evo attack, that's three. Okay, three, right, and you still have leadership. Uh, what happened to High Evo? Say what? Do I need a, oh, oh, okay. I think I need to restart. The uh, Lex is appearing over High Evo, not where you. Oh, okay. He so said he somehow um, moved up there. I got it. I moved him back. If you saw that. Okay. All right. Anyway. All right. So Sentinels hit. So it'll go to click two. That's right. Um, and then that's that's all I can do. <laughs> All right, let's roll for gems. Um, let's go for mind. Okay. Fair. Yeah. All right. Um, let's try to mind control. Thanos and ship. Okay. Uh, So it's going to be 18 and a 20. Yeah. Mm, Maybe. You know what? Let's do Luther instead of ship. Okay. Uh, Luther would be uh, Mm. just a blank 17. He's one power 17. All right. All right. So that, that, was, is... that was Thanos and Lex. Right? Then Thanos and Luther. Yeah. Okay. So Super Sense is on Thanos. Yeah. Okay, you got him. Okay. All right. Um, let's have. Oh, uh, you know, uh, yeah, I already rolled senses. I forgot to use my prop, but that's okay. Go ahead. You got him with prop. You can use. You can use the prop. That's fine. Okay. Yeah. And then prob. I would prob it with Thanos. That would be it. Okay. Um... It still hits. Same thing, yeah. So, all right. So let's have Thanos uh, punch Hayibo. Okay. Uh, Thirteen on eighteen. Yeah. Um, I will prob it with Chip. Okay. No, this is okay. So that's a mess. So one hit, one miss so far. Let's have Lex 
punch chip. Okay, 11 on 18. Okay, that KOs chippers. Yeah. Okay. And uh, catcher's mitt. Okay. So that is one hit, uh, two hits, and one miss. Yep. Um. So now let's have Lex. Let's have Thanos. Dual target shoot. Try and shoot at at a uh, high Evo and Lex. Okay. Oh. Super senses on high Evo? Uh, he just has defense, so you just knock him to a stop. Oh. So Lex is KO'd, and high oh. Evo will... Oh, right I, right, I missed him with the first one. Okay. Right, so high Evo just right. hit stop okay. click, and okay. he's just going to go chill out over here. Oh, he's able to do that. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, and any square on the map. Okay, cool. All right. oh, no, that's and really you need to cool. roll your willpower with Thanos, too, since you let me do that problem. Oh, thank you. No, I don't make willpower rolls with him anyway. Um, I found. All right, so that was three hits. So let's bring out Grodd. Okay. Um, let's get the extra... On the map, um, uh, I squares. Can I even damage Thanos with the Sentinel? No, uh, no, 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 not with unless. Oh, almost. Um, God, tight step to the yeah, Grodd can't damage him. Yes, but what we are going to do is try and set it up for next turn, hopefully. We'll see how things go. Sidestep, carrying Grodd. Okay. I'll put him back there. Um, yeah, and that is going to be my turn. All right, well, we'll start out with willpower, and then we'll go gems. Well... I uh, did that in the right order, but um, <laughs> so we'll just do uh, time, time, mine, space, um, and then we will um, we'll dual target mind control. Um, did you want to roll? For, uh, is that Evo cosmic powered? No, he's not. No. Okay. So we'll dual target mind control um, Thanos and uh, Grodd. Okay. Okay. That, wow. That, okay. Um, that was a 10 plus. So um, I get to do the penetrating damage. That worked out pretty well, actually. Um, so, uh, Thanos no. will attempt to punch, uh, Harris. well, you know, Harris. there's no, um, let's just dual target shoot Harry and, cause it's Harry on click three. Harry should be on click three. Yeah. Okay. So we'll just dual target shoot the Sentinel and Harry. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Um, we'll just go ahead and deal all three to Harry. Okay. Um, and then <laughs> we will use Grodd to punch the Sentinel. Sure. Jeez Louise. Okay, that's a dead sentinel. And then the after resolutions from the power gem will deal it to Grodd. Grodd. Okay. Um, All right. I'm sorry, Joe. That. Hey, it happens. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, um. 
And then, All right, so you have won this game unless I can KO your Thanos. Right, Thanos or, yeah. or High Evo, I guess, for real, too. No, you've gotten more points because you got two things that I brought in off of the sideline, so I can't. Oh, wow. And my, and my gem, so yeah, unless I can KO your Thanos, you, you've won the game already. Got you. Well, I'll just play it safe here, and we'll uh, du double perplex up uh, High Evo's uh, defense. Of course, we'll free phase nice. right there next to you. Yeah. Uh, I don't know why. There's no particular reason to, but uh, we'll clear my Thanos. All right. So, uh, willpower. Nope. Gems. Well, sorry, did That's not okay. mean to roll that. Same result either way. Um, so we're gonna go with um obviously we're gonna go with time. Um time, mind, and I mind and power. Okay. All right. Um, well, I have three. You only got two. Oh, right. Sorry. So time and mind. Okay. All right. Um, let's try and mind control your Thanos. Okay. Uh, you have super senses. Yeah, super senses. Bop. You got him. Okay. So. Six. Can I? I'm not sure if there's a point. I was. Six. No. It's too. Too far to reach your. Evo. Um, so let's just throw you into the corner. I don't know why. We're just going to do that. Well, you and could, like, that's... crit hit or something, right, and get, or even critically miss and get, like, a Vulcan or something to start doing more work, right? But I, I can't do, I can't get an attack off on how Evo. You're too far, he's too far away. Right. Well, I'm saying you have to try to KO my Thanos. But I, I can't. I don't. I have a token on, so I have to. No, I'm sorry, John. Yeah. No, no. yeah. I meant if you like were to crit hit or crit miss on the mind control, you could bring out. Something oh else. right. Well, I was. I hadn't counted it out before. I was kind of hoping that I'd be able to. Gotcha. Anyway. All right. Um, yeah. Close. Gems. <laughs> yes. <laughs> wow. Okay. Uh, mind. Mind, time, space, I guess. Um, and then, so let's just uh, start off with uh, shooting your Thanos. Mm -hmm. uh, prob? Yeah, prob. Okay. Super senses? Nope. All right, so that's for five. So five, right, so... Click four. Um, and, um, let's go ahead and uh, mind control. Okay. Potential hit. Super senses. Nope. Got that one. All right. So um, I will double perplex up high evo's defense. And um, I will go ahead and free phase to there and, okay. and call your go. All right. Uh, gems. <laughs> um, I think I have to take... I think I have to take time. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 
I mean, um, all right, so I'm gonna make a close attack. Sure. So 14 for three. That potentially hits. Uh, I'm not gonna problem, it's gonna roll senses. All right, so I'll go to quick two. Yes, increase your attack. All right. Um, yeah, go ahead. All right. Um, willpower, gems, two. So let's go time and um, time and um, space. Um, and then we'll just uh, punch your Thanos 15 attack this time. Yep. All right. There's Prob the that. Okay. Still a potential hit. Two senses. Right. Nope. Five more. So, uh, yeah. One, two, three, click seven. Uh, double perplex up High Evo's defense and call your turn. All right. Uh, gems. I have to take uh, power. Because I can't damage you otherwise. So. Yep. Willpower. Yeah. Yes, thank you. Alright. Nope. Neither one of us have right. made it. Made a willpower roll yet, just by the way. I, I've been playing Thanos for like three weeks now. I've made it oh, like yeah. once. So, alright. So, combat expert 13 for three. Um, senses. No sense out of that nope. one. Okay. All right. Uh, your turn. Um, willpower. Ooh, got it. And gems. Uh, we'll do. Maybe time. I should. Huh? Maybe I should have taken soul, but missed anyway. Free region. Uh, oh, well. we'll do, uh, time and uh, space. And uh, punch your Thanos. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I, yeah, I think that's all it is. <laughs> five damage, right? Yeah, five I more. Think... One, two, three, four. That puts me on 11. I okay. Think. Yeah. All right. <laughs> and double perplex up high able defense for go. <laughs> okay. Um. Gems. Hey, I get two. All right, so we're going to go with soul and power. Don't forget your uh, Yes, thank you. Willpower. Nope. Um, so, free region. Three. So, that'll put me back. One, two, three. Back on click eight. And clear. Okay. Uh, willpower. Got it. Jim. <laughs> uh, time and um uh, space. Mm -hmm. And uh, punch your Thanos. Do you need to not roll a crit miss? All right. Good game, Dan. All right. Good game, Joe. <laughs> I don't know how that could have uh, went any differently, in right? I mean, given that I won map, I mean that was. Um, I maybe I could have positioned a little bit better that that turn, but yeah, I think maybe not letting me have uh, bishop and bishop, Phoenix. yeah, yeah. Um, oh, yeah. three hundred to sixty-five, <laughs> one fifteen, one twenty-five, one fifty, one sixty. Oh no no that's that's your that's what you had KO'd. Sorry, it's three hundred to thirty yeah. 90, uh sorry, thirty, sixty, ninety-five, uh one oh five. Yeah, that's what I got too. Uh, um mm. Joe, one little bit of yeah. advice, if I may. Yep. Yeah. Um your beginning of turn rolls, roll willpower before gems. Okay. Because because 
knowing if you get willpower can actually affect the gem selection. That's a good point. I honestly was just hoping finding that the first rolls were usually worse, and I was kind of hoping. Don't buy into that superstition. <laughs> Is it really superstition with roll 20, Brad? I ain't Brad. Oh, sorry, Azra. Sorry. Is it is it really a superstition? Uh, roll twenty. Y- yes, I I play on roll twenty more than probably everybody in Hero Quest. <laughs> okay. Because right. I play D and D. Fair enough. I mean, just the way it seems to get stuck on rolls sometimes. It it <laughs> does look like that, but it's yeah, it's just a minuscule amount of rolls that we actually see based on the algorithm. Mm. Uh, I um, mean, when when you roll three ones in a row, sometimes yeah. But there are then you can have the rolls where you roll three sixes. I don't think I've ever had that back. happen for I me. Have. I have. <laughs> um, but so uh, it's just a good um point of order. No, is, you you are technically you you are technically correct. Yeah, that is a good point. Just I, like you should roll willpower mm-hmm. before leaderships. Mm. And roll your leaderships with the least amount of options first. Yes. No, that I, I usually do that to try and get the most out of it. Yeah. Just with the with just Thanos there and everything, I was just trying to like, okay, let's sure, just sure. get more. But yeah, you are technically correct. It's just I don't trust roll twenty. I really so two uh, of the three Thanos is one. <laughs> Well, I mean, two of them were playing each other. So. Yep. <laughs> uh, all right. Good luck, Dan. The rest. Oh, did he already leave? He's just on mute. Oh, okay. 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 I stepped out to go to the bathroom okay. quick. Okay. Yeah. Good luck for the rest of your games. Yep. You too, man. Oh, well, thanks everybody for watching tonight. Appreciate all five of y'all that are tuned in. So let's see, round started. Then we should be getting close to the round being over. So if y'all have any questions for me in chat, feel free to ask. While I'm in between rounds.
I still remember. I feel that the, I think he's he's been he's been in the meta for too long, annoying too many people. <laughs> uh, no, yeah, he's getting. Yeah, it's, that's what freaking Kenny was talking about. He's talking about basically they're gonna. I think they're gonna ban Jason for silver. No, yeah, I think that's almost like a given for sure. I heard about that too, and I think it's you have to because it's it's too problematic, right? Yeah, it's Jason's too good. It's too yeah. problematic. Jason Wingard. Jason's on the. Jason's it's a 15, the 20 minute turn. Most of the time. Hey guys. Yeah. How's it going, buddy? I heard you had a you had a Thanos dance off. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was um, it was uh, about like you would expect it to go. Did your power gem end up making the difference in the end? Uh, yeah, it did actually. I was able to because it seems like it would, I was able right? to out damage his Thanos. So right. That's how I feel that would go, yeah. But I think that if I had, like, the alchemical fire, I would have been able to outpace him with the negative two attack. Right, right. That's what I do. That's what I do versus Thanos as well when I'm fa facing him and I, and I have the alchemical fire. I just do that because otherwise it's just annoying. Right. That you so, can't really do much. But I was able to steal his power gem as well turn one, so that was helpful. Yeah, that's huge right there. That's a big deal. Yeah. Thanks, Chip. Do you think do you think moving forward the right call is the power gem? Mm. Well no, it's just a difference, right? I think Thanos needs to be able to shoot for six. Right. Right. I agree. So if you can shoot for six without the power gem, then you play the fire. Mm, right. So. That makes sense. That's why on your other team you could do it, right? Yep. Right. Yeah. Because Thanos was able to go for six on the other team. So. Right. Right. I do agree. I think six is the magic number, right? Where you want to ideally be at. Right. Six is the magic number for years. <laughs> <laughs> right. It has. That was Unimind. Unimind's thing is like, I can shoot for six. <laughs> right. <laughs> Far away. Yep. Yep. So we blame you, Daniel. Today we had three Thanos out of eight, and I blame you for being the the catalyst of the Thanos swarm. <laughs> yeah. Well, I tell you what, I'm I, I've sold some of my army of Thanoses, right? And uh, oh yeah, some of them have gone to uh, players that I know are like trying to attend PJ's event. Mm, and nice. I, and I've gotten like a couple of like. I really love your Spider-Man family Thanos team. And I'm like, that's why I'm buying your Thanos. And, you know, I'm like, <laughs> yeah. You're like, okay. <laughs> so, so so you are the catalyst. I was just joking. Now I know you are the catalyst. <laughs> right. Well, finding... you're not only, you're not only, motiv you're not only incentivating them to do it. You are also providing the the, the resources, <laughs> right? Well, I feel, like, like, I feel like I feel like I have to like you know I already I was already playing Thanos before I bought that collection, right? Oh, right. No, I know that. Yeah, but yeah, now sure. I feel like I have to play Thanos to try to get the rest of these sold. You gotta push it. Gotta push it, right? <laughs> you, gotta, you gotta push it. I gotta push the product. I gotta push the product. <laughs> Sounds like, uh, hey man, you want to get a Thanos? You know, like you, you crawl out of a dark corner. <laughs> yeah, hey man, you need a you need a sniff of that improved targeting everything. <laughs> man, this is the good one. This is not that other weird colored one. <laughs> yeah, this is the good shit. I will say this: at least we can't mind control drop the tank with Thanos. Right, that doesn't work anymore. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah, that's huge for sure. Now, do you think that I, I I personally think that Thanos will be all right even in Silver Age? Yeah, I think because I too. I think I think it changes nothing. I think honestly, if you ask me, I think we're just going to be playing mostly modern age figures with just a few elements of. Silver well, there's Age. some right? Silver Age figures have. that are really good. Like I already have right, my first. Uh, depending on Disney Plus, right? 
Um, right. I already have my first Silver Age team ready to go. Like, I don't even need to practice it. Like, I'm ready to go. Right. No, no, I understand. I understand yeah. that there are good things. You know, I understand Unimine is fantastic. No, I'm not going to. Uh, like... So I'm probably not going to play Uni. I will if the Rock Cup has a three v three. Um, I think my plan is to play Uni, and one of my uh, one of our other guys is going to play Thanos. Right. I think the the biggest drawback for Uni at the high point is not having the full damage pulse wave anymore because it used to kill a lot with that, right? Right at uh, three hundred, I wouldn't. I I would never play Uni at three hundred. That's just not. That's I don't. Right. I, I right, don't right, do right. going there. Yeah. Uh, right. I've kind of backed myself into a hole with that too because I think that two seventy five right. Goblin King's really good now, but uh, um, I've backed myself into a hole with that. So. Gotcha. We're gonna post pairings in a minute, so we can hop up to tournament chat. Oh, okay. Yep. Cool. Yeah. Summoning all of you from the ether. So you're the evil caster. I am I am the vampire. I felt the energy summoning all the, the spirits. Come come my creatures of the night. Can you summon a rabbit too? Uh, okay. So round now two. Now that's just uncalled for. <laughs> uh, what, round three, uh table one, Dan versus Jackson. Table two, Lewis versus Randy. Table three, Joe Alves versus David. Table four, Joe G versus Wesley. Table five, Richard versus Dennis. Thanos again tonight? Uh, no. I'm oh. assuming I'm fighting against a Thanos tonight, though. You are. Yeah, you are. Yeah. Nice, nice. I assume you have a theme. No? Yes, no? Yes, plus nine X Men. Okay, well you are plus three on me because I am unthemed tonight. All right. Let's go ahead and get left the all room this junk loaded. in the room. All right. Oh, I love it when they do that. Let's see what I can do. Boop. Oh, eleven. Oh, you wrote an eleven. Oh, oh, that was really close. Yeah. Ooh. That, uh, that definitely could have been a winning roll for me. So. Definitely could have. Ooh, we're losing to a Thanos is not fun. Not fun at all. Let me just get this set up. All right, time to pull out my 17,000 figures from the sideline. Oh, boy. A Jubilee. So exciting. Yay. Now, why do you think that? It, it's, it's almost, it might not be. You don't know that. It's almost like I've done this on this map before. Multiple no. dozens of times. Well, at least you get to set up first. Yeah. Dan, I listened to the podcast. I like the new format at the end. Where I just end the where I just end it? No, um where you have the first half as you guys talking about like announcement stuff, second half actually talking about like game stuff. Oh yeah, um, yeah. Yeah, that just so happened to work out this time. So. Oh okay. It happened um, to work out, Dennis. Um, Dennis is VGM. Uh, uh, Brad did that. <laughs> Brad has to. <laughs> if Brad's not available, you have to make a room for him right now. Or send him to another room. Or with our GM. yes. Yeah. Let yeah. me see if Brad's available. We're typically probably going to have two different formats for a while because we've got to figure out how to incorporate um, the Oxit stuff in there. So, Sure. I'm like, I think I have like an hour left of this week, so I pause it at the, when you're reading the Oxit thing, but so far I like it. Me and yeah, it's uh, definitely nice to talk about the news. Scott and I recorded today as well. Well, see, nice. the thing is, is that there's not always news, so... Yeah. Yeah, I mean, this week was, luckily, we got a lot of stuff, but, yeah, normally this is pretty, pretty bare. Uh, you. Let's look at everything. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm still pulling everything out. Oh, you're fine. <laughs> Are you 
underneath there. Okay. That's obviously the last one. All right, so Dazzler is just giving the shield team ability to both cable clones. Objects. Uh, that and that. All right. Five. Doing some nice unthemed Thanos stuff. That's fun. It's something. Definitely. It's definitely something. I think I just... I have a normal Thanos swap that I'm probably going to do, but I just put Beast on this team, and I kind of want to see how effective that is. Hmm. Maybe another time. I'll go ahead and post. Uh, we're ready. All right, I got that resolved. Okay. Going to use my room. Now only I'd be like, just just put him in, but put him in room two at all times. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I don't want to. I don't want to do that. That's, that's also like if eventually everybody. Here, eventually, everybody will play in this tournament. Will be a part of a GM in my room, and I can just easily just be like go, oh, just go to mine. Yeah. It's go hang, out with, but... go hang out with Horseman of Death Gambit. <laughs> Who that there? Who him is? Yeah. Brad, yeah. Um, I got it resolved. I just gave oh, them my room. Okay. Yeah. Okay, cool. I uh, should be free, but I might miss it later. Okay. Uh, uh, you. Can you give Can you give Dennis uh, GM in room five whenever you have a chance? Yeah, yeah, I fixed it. Perfect. Thanks, buddy. Yes, sir. You gonna do your swap, Jackson? I could do it now. Yeah, I know. We just wait till the game, so I have time to think about it. But Whew. that's a funny way to say "eat the clock." I mean, I know what swaps I'm gonna do. I just you clock the extra time to think about it. I was just oh hush. We were, I was just waiting to tell him we were good to go before. We <laughs> swap, so you lied. You said we were ready. We weren't ready. You haven't done your swaps yet. Hey, legally we are ready. It is the beginning of the game, sir. Judge. Yeah. Damn it. Oh wait, that's me. wait. <laughs> yeah. Wait. No. I'm sorry. Uh -huh. I'm cheating. Disqualified. Yep. You're out of here. Yeah. Throw you out like no. an umpire. <laughs> no, let me just do. Yeah, get you out. You out for you. Dan, I love the consistency of. I see every game of yours, you play two light objects and they never get used. Right. <laughs> Always it is very true. Off. I always play three maps, too. That's fair. Yeah, I'll, I'll just do my swaps now. It's fine. Uh, yeah, I'll just swap out uh, Maggot, Bishop Prime, 40 points for 40 points. Uh, bottom Professor X, 25, 10-point multiple man. This multiple man's now worth 25 points. 35-point uh, Dazzler for 50-point Jubilee. Uh, it's the end of the first swap. Other Professor X is going to swap. I'll swap out. 75 point cable. For, I think I just got to go basic. Yeah, I'll swap in for Venom Mag Wolverine. 
and then 25 point uh, Professor X out for 25 point Magneto. And uh, that's, that's it. Okie dokie, artichokey. So everyone's same point except that one multiple man. Uh, Venom Wolverine is she's worth a hundred though. Hmm? Venom Wolverine's worth a hundred. No, she's worth seventy five. You only score the twenty five additional points if you KO my entire force. No, as if you KO her. We can ask Al yeah, or in here. KO Venom Wolverine, you get you get the you get the additional cost of the trade. Um, She's only worth seventy five for swaps. The reason I yeah the reason I say no is because this came up during the three v three. I mean, Brian ruled it differently, but I could be yeah, wrong. Well, so it's it's always it's been that way since twenty seventeen, and nothing's changed since then. The example was is that you always scored the points of Uni with his blue flames. Because you could play under with, you could play under 150 with two Eternals, um, but you always got the 160 or 165 with the two blue, two or three blue flames. Yeah. So those things carry over. You just can't use, it's just their printed point value for the swaps. So... No, you're right. I'm, I'm I'm must be thinking something oh, else. Yeah, I'm surprised Brian ruled it that way. No, I I it was a different. Now that I think about it, it was a completely different thing. Or not completely different. It was a, it was a cable swapping for seventy five, but it was uh, what was it? It was a it was a different swap thing. Oh. It was swapping for less points than what it was. That was what the argument was. But Venom Venom Wolverine's probably pretty hard to KO, so. Oh, definitely, yeah. Probably, <laughs> probably won't be doing that. Eh, probably not. Good thing in our judge that we definitely said that for the 25 points we KO that character. What'd you say? <laughs> oh, and our Judge Chat stuff that that was the way how Chris said it and yeah Anthony Chris and Ed and Kenny all agreed to that. I remember because Brian Brian brought it up brought it up I guess during or after the three v three tournament again and we confirmed that you score the extra twenty five points. Yeah, yeah, that's what, and that's, that's what the uh, that's the uh, House of X O forty four Magneto, right? Yeah, the yeah. rare, the twenty five point retail uh, leadership rare. Yeah. All right, I'll I'll try to remember to freaking post that on the wind tonight and get them to clarify because he's he's been asking us to get stuff up there to get clear that needs clarified. Yeah, it, there's a lot of stuff that we basically have like we know it works this way, but we just need to get it you know, it's certified the when they're scoring. Somewhere. You know, it's in the comp. Like for this exact example, it's specifically in the comp. Like I just read it, and it's literally when you pay for uh, additional effects, the that game element scores when it's KO'd, even when it's replaced. It's still that same game element. How was the uh, vacation? It was fun. Yeah, had a big cabin for all the kiddos and stuff, so. It's fun. It's kind of a mountainy tourist trap town, but it's fun. We go once a year, a couple times a year. Yeah, 
It was always fun. Let's see here. My family kind of does the same thing. We just drive out to like a mountain town and just rent a cabin and kind of camp on the river. It's always fun. I don't understand how it takes 15 minutes to set up a game. Wild. Uh, let's... I mean, we got new players tonight, so. Yeah, let's see. No. No. Waiting on David and Joe and other Joe. Yeah, we got ready quickly. Then Lewis and Richard. Richard's new and he got ready quickly. Yeah, it it just depends so on the just person, honestly. We're on uh, one, two, three. We're waiting on Joe and Wesley. That Wesley's new though, and then we're waiting on um, yeah, David and Josapha. That's weird that they're waiting on those two play a lot. So I think they're actually ready, and they just never said it. Yeah, oh, no, Joe no, no, doesn't no. post it. No, no, no. David posted it in the score report at nine forty one. Ah, okay. And now Joe just put it in the wrong channel as well. God damn it. Yeah, people are pretty... Okay, that's explaining it. All right, so that's table three, table four, table one, table two, table five. Okay, you guys are good to start. Yeah. All right. Okay. Good luck, man. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, beginning the turn, move the Sentinel one square. Uh, I don't believe you have anyone with the X-Men or Brother of the Mutants keyword on your team, do you? No. All right. Uh, the bottom cable is going to free TK the spin ring to himself, and he will equip it. I'll color him a different color from the other one so you can know he's the equipped one. Uh, all right, so then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just move the cable in the back to there to there, picking up motion modifier. And then sidestep, drop in a Venom Wolverine square. And she will equip it. Uh, I'll go ahead and say minus one defense with the emotional modifier. Okay. And go ahead and wildcard the underworld team ability with uh, Venom Wolverine. And should be about it. Yeah, it's about it. So I'll go ahead and end my turn there. Okay. Oh, sorry. One last thing. I'll, uh, Bishop will just phase and teleport in place to make shard. Okay. That's um, it. so let's go ahead and, uh, roll for, uh, gems. Mm -hmm. Uh, three. So let's just do mind and time. And um, let's go ahead and um, TK the power gem back to Thanos, who will equip it. Mm -hmm. And then let's go ahead and sidestep to no, I don't want to sidestep yet so let's just go ahead and power action barrier with molecule man And then we will uh, sidestep to here, so one, two, carrying Molecule Man to here, and um, 
Faust to or High Evolutionary to there. Um, Sounds good. And Thanos to there. And then we will Smoke Cloud with Molecule Man. One, two, three, four, five, six, and um, then we'll roll to convert to. So we'll do this one and that one and um, high evolutionary will double perplex up chips defense and mm -hmm. I will call your go. Okay. Let's go uh, leadership with Magneto. Nope. Um, yeah, move for square with the Cyclops Sentinel. All right, so bunched up there. I like it. Twenty twelve, by ten. Got to make that there, there. One, two, three, four, five, six. It hits. Potential, potential. Not. I like those odds. They're not great odds. Okay, for TK. Then. Then. A lot of ifs. A lot of ifs. All right. Let's go ahead and sidestep Jubilee. Go ahead and spin you. I'll spin you now. Yeah, Jubilee will go big. So I'll turn it to click number nine. Go ahead and move that. That go one, two, three, four, five, six, ten, ten, all of that. Yeah. Yep, she'll just go ahead and get free TK'd by the uh, Cable Clone. Actually, no, he'll uh, Power Action TK. I'll sidestep before I do it. Power Action TK, one, two, three, four, five, six. And I'll go ahead and running shots. I want you to get about... There's fair. And then I running shot there. I can just get it either way, it's fine. Yeah. Yep, so she'll run a shot to right there. And I'll shoot uh, dual targeting Chip and Thanos, because I believe everyone else is in stealth. Yeah, so 11 on um, a 19 on 21. All right. That's just hidden Thanos. Um... I'll prob it with Thanos. All right, so that's missing them. Go ahead and save theme probs, it's fine. Okay, do that. I'll go ahead and clear all terrain from her range, so... Everything but that one barrier.
He's perplexed. Uh, yeah, it's fine. I'll, right, then I'll go ahead and uh, free TK Venom Wolverine. One, two, three, four, five, six squares. Uh, spin. Uh, who's, I believe I need a. Who's doing the TK? The. The cable. Oh, okay, gotcha. I believe I need to spin ring first because that's only within three squares. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, so I just spin ring first, then TK. One, two, three, four, five, six. And she can go ahead. Move. I won't, I won't have line of fire. No what I do, that's fine. Yeah, so she'll full speed just move right there. Okay. Uh, and with two action tokens, I'll go ahead and make a free attack on Molecule Man. Okay. So 12 on an 18. Yep. That's yeah, hitting for three penetrating. Um, I'll prob it with um, Chip. Uh, missing, and now starts the bullcrap of attempting to prob it with Jubilee. Okay. I'm Success. Yep. It's a three, yeah. All right, so I'm down to two theme probs. Okay. Hitting. He's gone. All right. And I'll go ahead and swap to Battle Fury with the emotional modifier. Okay. And that's all of my actions, so I'll go ahead and clear the cable in the back, and Bishop, and go Ooh. ahead and call your go. Okay. Um, so let's go ahead and roll uh, gems with Thanos. Um, we will choose... Um, Battle Fury matters. Uh, we'll just choose phasing. All right. And um, we will uh, go ahead and roll for willpower. Nope. Um, so um, let's see. Five will be 14 for five with uh, potential there. So let's just go ahead and, um, she just can't be targeted by ranged attacks, right? I can still outwit her, right? Yeah. yeah, if you can see her, you can. She just can't be targeted by ranged attacks. You can okay. target her in general though. Right, 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 right. Okay, that's what I was after. All right, so. Yeah. Um, so let's just go ahead and boop with Faust to here. And let's outwit her super senses. Okay. Because she doesn't have... Yeah, okay. She doesn't have a reducer, just the thing. Okay. So yeah. let's just... Um... Sorry, if if it's okay, I want to boop to here, if that's okay. You're good. Okay. Uh, then boop to here with Thanos, with Thanos outwitting the super senses. Um, so let's just go, um, 13, uh, sorry, 14 for five on a 20. Okay. Yep. Okay. Yep. All right. So one, two, three, four, five. So I'm going to stop click with the power gem. Yep. All right. So click six. Token. And, um... Then, uh, let's see, high evolutionary is my, we'll just go ahead and double perplex up high evil's attack, mm -hmm. and go 13 on an 18. Okay. Uh, yep, yeah. All right, so it's not really, I mean, it's, you have two probs and you need a fives and you're a faust so that's not really worth it okay yeah, let's do that um so you know what i forgot to make a chip um a thingy last turn that would have helped me with stuff um but i will 
make that thingy now um, and that thingy will sidestep picking up the emotional modifier and autonomously uh, destroying it by throwing it at nothing. All right. And um, then Chip will sidestep uh, carrying Faust to here and Thanos to here. And uh, I think that is it. I'll clear chippers and call your go. All right. So willpower and jubilee. Unfortunate. Uh, move a square with sentinel. Let's go ahead and double check that because I'm like 99% sure I can't. Okay, so that's just a free. And it's only that, so that doesn't matter. You fair two, three, four, five, ten, hit that, hit that. We got a lot of that, a lot of that. Fortunately, you can probably hit that. That's just my best call. 3TK, not gonna help, not gonna help. All right, so let's go ahead and spin ring the Cyclops Sentinel right there. Let's go ahead and go with him. One, two, three, four, five. So for DK, four, five, six, sidestep. One, two, three, four, five. You're still right there. Step. That sucks. And yes, there's no way I can get that to there. All right. Uh, okay. I believe there's, there's obviously no way I can really get away from that. You, you. There, obviously. There. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and running shots with Jubilee. She'll go probably right there, yeah. I'll just run a shot to right there. Okay. Shooting, you know, I'll shoot uh, Chip and Thanos. Okay. So 11 on 20 and 18. Yep. Hitting um, both of them. I will prob it with Faust. Uh, she'll attempt to theme prob it. May do it again, even. That'll hit Thanos. Okay, so put him on quick four. Okay. Token. Right, no. Uh, no, you dealt him two, so click three. Yeah. Hoping to hit that. That's fine. Don't really think. Then yes, your warning shot's five. Eight, nine. There's really no way I can... No, I can. Yeah. 3TK. Sidestep. 3TK carries. Okay. Go ahead and uh, 3TK back cable himself. One, two, three, four, five, six. Can go one, two, three, four, five. 
eight, nine, ten. Obviously super risky, but eh, I like risks, they're fun. Then, yeah, it's about there. TK, run him there. Right. Well, uh, sidestep Magneto to right there. I'll go ahead and have Magneto move right there, carrying cable. That's two actions. Uh, third action. It's just running shots. One, two, three, four, five. With Cyclops Sentinel carrying that cable. And I'll go ahead and shoot Chip with the plus two range. Uh, 11 on a 20. 20. Yep. Oh, got one theme prop left. And looks like I'm going to need it. Why can I not edit this? That's why. Uh, so I'll use my last theme prob sure. with just himself. I believe I'm out of range of Faust. Yeah. 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 Eh, yeah, it was a risk. All right. And that's about all I can do. So let's go ahead and move the last action. Move that multiple man right there. And end my turn. Okay. Um, let's roll willpower on Thanos and gems on Thanos. So let's just do. Um, I guess we'll just do time and mind. That shard being there is annoying. Um. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, we'll definitely get there. Um, he has eight. So we'll go ahead and double perplex up. Um, Chips movement and right. carry everybody ten to that square. Uh, obviously, we're going to be KOing the the thing. Mm -hmm. But we'll go in there, in there. Let's see one. Let's see. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, and then five to there, and then height Evo will go to there. Um, one, two, three, and we'll go ahead and outwit energy shield deflection here. All right. Um, and then we will uh, dual target mind control, um, Jubilee. And uh, the Cyclops Sentinel? The No and Jubilee. Okay, so um, we will go ahead and do um, the cable what, The cable clone's 11 for 3? Yes. Okay. Um, so we'll just do the uh, cable clone instead. Okay. Um, so... Uh, You're what, like a 16? A 16 attack. So, it's 20. It's 20s? Yeah. So, um, we'll go ahead and, um, that, that mint goes away. I don't want to forget that. So, we'll go ahead and have, um, this guy, uh, Giant Reach, um, uh, you know what? We'll have the Cable Clone go punching Magneto first. All right. So 11 out of 17. Yep. Okay. All right. Uh, I'll go ahead and... Let's see if this was on fire instead. Uh, this is the Cable Clone punching? The Cable Clone punching the 25-point Magneto, yeah. All right. And you still have Cyclops Sentinel, so I can't mastermind to him. 
I can't mastermind him, yeah. And I'm not within line of fire with anyone else. He's not within range. Yeah, all right. So, yeah, let's just take that. Um, And then this is the one with the spin ring. Um, let's see, one, two, three, four. We'll attempt to shoot Jubilee first. With uh, Cyclops Sentinel? Yeah. No. Um, so we'll just punch the... Actually, I couldn't have shot her anyways. Because uh, of Shard. Um, yeah. So we'll just have the uh, Cyclops Sentinel uh, punch the uh, spin ring cable. All right. 11 on 17. It hits, so take two, which I believe just kills me. Yeah, just kills him and kills okay. the ring. Um, and then, let's see, one, two, one, two, three, four, five. We'll send him back up to here. All right. And um, then we will, let's see, one, two... Uh, we can get everybody in. Uh, looks like. Let's see. We'll sidestep. And uh, let's see where they are. Oh, I placed them in there. One, two, three, four. Okay. So we're going to sidestep to here, carrying everybody. High Evo goes here. Faust goes here. Thanos goes there. Uh, then Faust will boot to there. All right. Um. And then clear here and clear Thanos. All right. Uh, so willpower on Jubilee. Wow. Okay. Uh, Cyclops Sentinel. Took it off him. Uh, what are the gems you picked again? Uh, time and mind. I just wrote them in okay. there. Just. So gems four. Unfortunate. Well, that makes that easier. We'll go to free. So I'll start off with a free move with Cyclops Sentinel. Mm -hmm. well, I was hoping to have Jubilee do something, but oh, that's just unfortunate. Well, yeah. I'd have to move there, there, get there. Hit that and go one, two, five. Yeah, it's best I can do, unfortunately, but it's not terrible. Uh, let's go ahead and move the cable clone to right there. Free TK up Bishop to right there. Okay. Uh, let's go in a running shot with Bishop. One, two, three, four. And shoot to cable. Shoot. Um, a plus two attack and plus one damage because you have probability control. Shoot. Cable or Thanos? Ah, uh, Thanos. Sorry. Uh, Bishop is shooting Thanos. Gotcha. So, 13 for 4. Thanos. Yep. That's hitting, I think. Oh. Nope, it's not, because you have defend. I do have defend. Yeah. Wow, I'm just... I know I did a bad swap, but I could at least get some luck here. Alright. Uh, 1, 2, 3... Let's see. Yeah, just gonna go ahead and running shot right there, Cyclops Sentinel, and shoot Thanos. Okay. All right. Um, clear Jubilee, clear multiple man. Your go. Got Sorry, man. Outwit. Eh, it's just dice happens. Uh, let's roll leadership with um high Evo. Uh, gems on Thanos. Um, so I guess we've just got to do two, three, four. Uh, we'll just do, um, 
Uh, we're just gonna do mind, I guess. Uh, Team sir. And uh, Faust will outwit Bishop's special defense power. Mm -hmm. And sorry, I'm just gonna lock mind. I don't know if I said that out loud. We're gonna go mind. No, you did. Okay. Um. So we'll go ahead and um, I want special defense power and um, go ahead and shoot um, Bishop for five damage. Maybe more. Oops, six. Six damage. I don't know. You have like a 16 attack. Yeah. Uh, shoot. Okay. All right. Get rid of old Bishop and Shard there. Mm-hmm. Um, and then we will, um, attempt to dual target mind control, uh, Cyclops Sentinel and Jubilee. No and Jubilee. Dang, that's three shape changes in a row with her. Um, let's just redo to the cable clone. All right. Uh, does three kill multiple man at 10 points? Uh, yes. He said two clicks with toughness. Okay. So, uh, it's a big old 16 attack. Uh, mm -hmm. them both. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So let's go one, two, three, four, five. Um, and make sure that we didn't go outside eight range. Attempt to shoot Jubilee with, oh, Jubilee's mine. Oh, Jubilee's not mine. Attempt to shoot Jubilee with Cyclops Sentinel. All right. All right. 11, 11 and 19. Uh, that misses. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nope, no probs. So let's just go um, Cyclops Sentinel, or not Cyclops Sentinel, the Cable Clone. We'll go after the 25-point uh, multiple man. All right. And we'll hit him. All right. Um, and that resolves my mind control. Um, we will go ahead with High Evolutionary, and he will double perplex up his attack to a 13, and we will support Thanos. Who? Uh, and then support, it's minimum two, so he just goes back to top dial. Click one. Uh, let's see. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, still can't. Oh, there is two squares of hindering down there. Um, so uh, let's just go ahead and uh, boop with Faust and move with Chip. Carrying everybody there, there, there. I didn't like go like illegally too far, did I? Because he was here. Uh, I there, sidestep. So you we'll could go. Uh, yeah, we'll just. Go I mean, if you sidestep, you're fine. Yeah, we'll eight and then go to the sidestep to there. It'll be fine. Um, yep. And then we'll swap these two around. Boop, bop, bop. Bop. Right. Um, can't do any outwits, so that is me. Well, I statistically can fail Willpower with Jubilee this turn, but I can't at the same time, so that's great. That's uh, Willpower with Cyclops Sentinel. All right, I think they're going to have him. Um, I oh. mean, I could do a metric crap ton of damage, but I don't okay. think I can actually. And if you're not okay, that's okay. I was going to make the mitt. I forgot to make the mitt. Um, it's up to you. I'd kind of rather you didn't. Okay, that's fine. I forgot to do it. No problem. No, it's all right. Uh, although with my dice, it probably doesn't matter anyway. But let's see. So I can free TK, kill TA, attack, attack. Kind of the best I got. 
Or I can just go... I honestly like that much more, because I hate this stupid Faust. One, two, three, four, five, six, yeah. If I move... Nine... No. Alright, I like this better. It's phasing cable. It's free TK Jubilee to there. Uh, and let's well, you can't dual target. Be that square oh. with. I don't think. Yeah, you can. Never mind. All right, go ahead. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Uh, do that, and let's uh dual target punch Faust and Thanos. Okay. So eleven on a seventeen and 18. or eighteens, yeah. Eleven on eighteens. Hit. Uh, prob chip. Nope. Uh, all right. Go ahead. Oh. No, I forgot to move one square with Cyclops, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, go five. Yeah. Here, let me. I mean, I can't. I can't obviously outrange your thing, so I'll just running shot to there. Cyclops Sentinel. And shoot chip. Okay. Um. Mean Actually, I mind I mind the range of you. No, no, you're not. Can't see. That's that's where. Right. Yep. I'm just gonna crit hit. Ooh, that's not a crit hit. All right, that's all my actions. So I'll go ahead and end my turn. Uh, you still have leadership on Cyclops Sentinel. He does have leadership, doesn't he? Yeah. Um, it doesn't. R I'm not. Yeah, I mean, much man doesn't really matter. There's not much left. I I mean, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nah, nah, you just get him. Like, I want to eventually move up to punch you, but you're just going to mind control against me, so it's fine. Right. Stay right. back. Um, leadership high Evo, Willpower <laughs> Thanos, Gems Thanos, so two gems. We'll choose uh, Time and Mind, um, and we will attempt to dual target, shoot... Jubilee and Cyclops Sentinel. All right. Shape change on Jubilee. Roll two. Oh, sorry, I see it there. Uh. Hits. Fourteen on a eighteen. I did miss the Cyclops Sentinel, so. Um. We. Oh yeah, you healed off your fifteen attack. Yeah. So, uh, we'll just deal all six to Jubilee. Take a mystics that you reduce. Right. Um, and then we will uh, mind control Cyclops Sentinel and the cable. Right. Bop. Ooh, that's a good one. Because I get to do the mind, the power gem. Yep. Um, so we'll first of all, we'll go. Um, we're gonna go eight, so we'll just go move him to there, uh, shooting the multiple man. All right, 11 on 17. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, I'll prob it with Thanos 18. And then the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I will walk up to here, uh, punch Cyclops Sentinel, All right. and that will hit him for three, and then after resolutions, we'll deal him the one penetrating damage on the power gem. Alright, um, Cyclops Sentinel. Oh, you're not going to let me make the Sentinel head first? Okay, that's fine. Huh? Not gonna let me make the sentinel head first. Okay. Well, I did. I made the sentinel shoot the Maya, the multiple man first. No, I when he takes damage, I can make a sentinel head bystander, but it's after resolutions, and you have the power gem, so it doesn't matter. Oh yeah, so yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna let you make this. I'm gonna let you make the sentinel. No, I get. Head. Oh come on, it'd be fun. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I, I think only one time out of like playing against Cyclops Sentinel that I've been able to make it once. So. I've never made it, yeah. I think I think I've only let my opponent make it one time. 
That's yeah, that's her. Oh, we can just call it there. It's it's a clone. Uh, you've actually actually no, that is game. I have no figures on the board that are worth any point values, so yeah, that's right, game. Right. So three hundred right. to thirty. Yeah, I uh, I got scared of Thanos. I did my Thanos swap. I should have just stuck to my normal one. I don't know why you moved Venom Wolverine all the way out. I was eh, basically just trying to battle fury out, but me being the big old dum dum forgot the f- outwit of Faust. I'm I'm used to playing Fire Cosmic people, so my first thought is, oh, I can't be outwitted. Oh, wait, no, I can be outwitted. I'm stupid. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of like, I didn't expect you to just yeet out Venom Wolverine and just KO the guy. Yeah. I was like, well, I'd have to just loop over and punch the crap out of Venom Wolverine, I guess. Pretty much, yeah. It was. It's also just she's kind of like survivable, I guess. Not if you're a fifteen attack, but eh. I was a fourteen on that one, and then you did, you oh, did only a fourteen. Yeah, you did miss quite a bit on the. the yeah, I don't. Uh, let me do the math. Would I have actually? I don't think I would have actually KO'd him because I was gonna do five then four. I don't think that's enough. Because one, two, three, then one, two. Yeah, no, he would have been on click eight. It would have been plenty. Oh, no, I just swapped wrong and then misplayed Venom Wolverine. Right. It happens, man. That's good. I like this. I'm, I don't know, I'm beginning to unlike this un I'm beginning to like this unthemed Thanos a little bit more. Yeah. I mean hey, you almost won map with it too. Yeah. People are scared of uh Faust. Like he uh he incites fear, like So with this team, especially Last week, every single match, um, I the opponent had a Faust. I luckily won map every time, but my opponent had a Faust. And every single alpha with Jubilee, I rolled not higher than a 5, and then couldn't prob it because of Faust. Right, yeah. Like, Faust just straight up wins games multiple times. Like, he, he won, like, two games against me last week. Yeah, I haven't done, like, like, I haven't, like, rolled anything good. Like, I haven't, like, just outright denied anybody something yet, I don't think, unless I did it to you. Um, but like they're just like, should I prob? Should I not prob? And I'm like, I don't know. You tell yeah. me, and then I'll roll my thingy. Yeah. Like there have been times when like I'll prob with like Venom Wolverine, and it's like, oh, well, you're not gonna roll a six, and they roll a six, and then I'm off my good click, and it's like, okay, well then she's just dead. Like it, she Faust just straight up is I think scarier than Thanos. He just. He's so hard to KO if you don't have close combat. Like, and even then, just eating the Mystic sometimes is extremely annoying. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm yeah. going to take a quick bathroom break and go for the next round all right. good game jackson all right you too man yeah. have a good one
Hey Sam, thanks for tuning in tonight. Just saw your note. Uh, so let's see. 7.34. We didn't really put in there when we started. I don't really know. 8.48. So, yeah, we still probably got around 15 minutes or so. Before the next round starts. So, if you have any questions for me, let me know again. All two people that are watching right now. Appreciate the two people that are watching. So tomorrow I am going to go get another collection. Certainly not like buying collections like Howard or Pat and Majestics does, but picking some picking up some relatively local collections from some folks getting out of the game. And should pick up some pretty good Silver Age pieces. Um in this pick in this um collection, so I'm glad they made that Silver Age announcement. Gave me a little bit more motivation to pick up this collection. So, it'd be cool to see what all I get out of that. And be checking out some of that stuff in the trade forums over the weekend. For the two folks that are watching the stream, if you'd like to give me, buy some of my wares. But we'll have one more round. We were the first game done pretty quickly. So, still cold weather here in Kentucky. Kind of sucks. I'm ready for some nice warm weather to be outside.
Looks like there is a win a case up in Washington tomorrow, Washington State, and then in Oklahoma they have a win a case going on as well. So we'll have some competitive results to cover over the weekend and record about on the next podcast. So that'll be interesting. A little pre Disney Plus meta. We saw we did see on Scott Porter's Instagram that he has Disney Plus in hand, so the unboxing for that should be coming soon. So pretty excited about that. Hoping that set brings us some really cool stuff. Like some really cool stuff. Like after War of the Realms, I could really use a wowzer of a set. Just personally. Like some OP stuff. Yeah, we're coming up on an hour since everybody was ready, so I assume the game will be over with soon. Round will be over with soon. It's kind of a long round, I guess. Back up to five viewers. Appreciate y'all. Tuning back in. Down to four. Dang. Shouldn't have said anything. But next round, probably about another ten minutes or so. Hopefully a little bit less. If you ever ask yourself, what does Daniel do in between rounds? He plays Clash of Clans, so. 
should stream my Clash of Clans. I've actually played Clash of Clans. I've mentioned this a few times. I've played Clash of Clans longer than I have HeroClix. I think this is my ninth year of playing Clash of Clans. But I just finished Clan Games. And just finished this month's rewards. And I have a fully maxed out base again as of about a month ago. But just a random fact about about myself. But round is over. So we'll hop back in the tournament chat. Dennis, or, uh, I haven't seen you. Is this your first time playing in one of these? It is second time. I played uh, at the beginning of February. Oh. <laughs> nice to talk to you. I'm a, a big fan of the podcast. I listen to it all the time. <laughs> oh, well, thank you. Appreciate it. Where are you, uh, where are you out of, Dennis? Toronto. Toronto. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, so I know a lot, probably a lot of the Toronto players you're familiar with, if, if you know any of them. Sure, sure. I can't say I know who they are off the top of my head, but I'm sure that I know them. I, I think Jay might be. Like uh, Jay Solomon, yeah. Yeah, yeah, Jay and uh, Tom and Mike. And... Yeah, the Married with Clicks crew there, they don't they don't make YouTube videos anymore, but uh, Jay Collins and his wife Amber Collins, and yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wesley, how about you? Are you are you new to the? I haven't seen your name before, but I haven't played the past couple of weeks. So, no, this is my first event ever, live or uh, online. Oh wow! Are you enjoying it? Yeah, yeah, it's pretty nerve wracking. <laughs> right. But uh, my second game went better than my first. Right. And where are you? Uh, where are you out of, Wesley? Deanna. Where where I think where at again? Deanna. Oh, okay. Um I think I've have you been posting about like preparing for PJ's event? I am. Okay, well cool. Well I'll be able to I'll be able to meet you there in a couple of weeks a few weeks then. We're uh, we're all planning on coming, cool. so awesome. Yeah, this is a great way to get practice in for an event like that. Yeah, I think uh, from the Clicksoft team, there's going to be six of us there. So I'm bringing in at least two, maybe three other people from where I live. Yeah, it should be pretty big. Pretty big event, well attended. I think Azrus is coming in even here. I will definitely talk about PJ's event. Yeah. Yep, I will be there. Jackson, think, you, uh, did, me... you, did you arrange to fly in or no? I'm still trying to book a flight because currently the cheapest one available is about five hundred and eighty dollars. So uh, unless it magically goes down in the next few weeks, I don't know if I'll make it. Right, that's fair. Yeah. I want the bus tickets, man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's only a 30 hour drive, so. Where do you live? I live in LA. Oh, okay. Yeah, there's been, yeah, the there's been, I mean, we, you know, a lot of, a lot of times everyone makes fun of us on the Midwest for having all the events, but I know quite a few folks, including myself, that have been out to LA, so. Yeah, I've uh, I've been to LA. I've I've been in LA for like eight hours. No, I'm just saying yeah. specifically <laughs> traveling to play clicks in LA. Oh yeah. no, I was it, I was there for work. Like, I had I have no problem it. flying to an event. Yeah. I'm all for it. It's it's just when the tickets are this high, it's not worth it. It's, no, I know. Un unfortunately, unfortunately, the weekend of the event is spring break, so it's causing tickets to oh, be like wow. three times okay. the normal price. Yeah. 
I mean, don't fly spirit. We want you to actually arrive. So. <laughs> oh. <Yeah. laughs> That's Matt Donham always flies spirit. Dude, that was I mean, hilarious. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, there's just no way. No way. Yeah. Ho- hopefully, hopefully they announce a date for freaking Memphis though. That'd be dope. Yeah. I just I really, 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 really hope it's not the last weekend of September. Uh, because I have tickets to see John Mullaney and I've already posed the idea of telling my friend that I would be going to Memphis instead because she bought the tickets and uh, that was not received very well. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I would say... I mean, it is most, John Mulaney. They did, um, if it was like last time, I think they did it Labor Day weekend or the weekend after Labor Day. I can't remember exactly. Yeah. It was early in the month, yeah. so... There's no guarantee. I, I hope they do a Labor Day weekend. I mean, there's no guarantee, obviously, but um, you know, that would that would hopefully yeah. fall in line with that. So, because if they do it Labor Day weekend, that's like a day off that most people don't have to take, and that's kind of a great a great thing, right? Yeah. All right, guys. We have Labor Day in Canada too at the same time. We got round three coming up. So we have pairings here of Dan versus Lewis, Joe A versus Randy at table two. Sorry, Dan and Lewis are around at table one. Um, Jackson versus Dennis at table three. up you there lewis can you hear me dan i can hear you now all right good i've been having to do that all night. i'm having to reset my mic oh you already got all your stuff out that's very nice very yeah, convenient. i was in here i was in here last round so see i thought i was gonna be in here after round one but no I just ended up in a table two. Not cool enough for the big boys table. Right. Do you have a theme? I do. Scientist. Okay. So you got a plus three on me. And there's an 11 for my map roll. Nice. So you probably win map. Don't know. Jackson and I both rolled 11. Yep. Well, that's a yep, turn that's... of events. Uh, yep. All right, if you want to pull out the it's rest of your team, on. so I can see what it is. Yep. Yeah. That's pretty exciting. Yeah. Oops. No, wrong wizard. Well, this is not gonna go well. I don't think. For me, anyway. Are you playing Let's the see, uh, the wizard uh, thingy did, did. with the mission point yep. stuff? Yep. Okay. Um, and it's when you break blocking on my side of the map. Correct. Okay. But I do get. I will be able to get first. Yeah, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna go in the workshop. Do you want the elevated side of the workshop or the uh, the not elevated side? Mm, I'm pull it out so I can okay. see the full thing again. Uh, it's been a while since I've seen that map. Uh, I don't know what's better for me. I guess. Sure, we'll go with the. I'll go with the um, elevated side. Okay. Uh, probably making a dumb choice, but okay. I don't know if there is a right or wrong choice, to be honest with you, but see, I'm just sick of I'm sick of tired of uh, putting my uh, 
all my stuff in a folder and it still comes up gigantic. So then I'm just like, yeah, forget it. Oh, this is taking too long. I don't want to take too long. Well, uh, the heck with it. I used to gonna... drag my stuff out one by one. I've never made folders or anything. You can highlight them all, though, and, like, do that. How do you do that? You just highlight them all. Like, you click and drag. I can't, like, show you. You have to, like, oh, click. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, click and drag and highlight over all of them. Yep. Um, I do not have the map the right size. Something is either off about the room or off um, about the map. Hey, Azareth, could you yeah. drop an Iron Man's workshop into room one? Of course I can. I'm either doing something wrong or I, I don't know. I don't know exactly what I'm doing actually. And I'm wrong. Uh, the elevated side goes towards uh, um, Lewis. Oh, sorry. What the hell? Where's there? You go. Let's see. Is that right? Where's the rest of my stuff? I thought I had it. Okay. That looks good. good. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what I was doing wrong, but I was doing something <laughs> not right. I I saw you guys like I saw the map like moving around a lot. I'm like, I'm gonna go see what's going on. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. We're not doing something right, that's for sure. It's alright. Oy. So yeah, I'm thinking this is kind of an auto loss with uh, losing map to Thanos with this team. I don't know. You have but a we'll lot. See. You have a lot of attacks. So uh, yeah, but it's I also have a lot of squishy characters that Thanos can easily one shot, or you can have me one shot with your mind controls. So are you playing the we'll modifier see. though? I am not. Oof. Yeah. And there's nothing that's I can what I, do that's one thing I kind of figured. Yeah, there's nothing I can do to stop you from uh, transforming into the Prime Wrecker, so if you would like to just go ahead and do that. Yeah, okay, so sorry. Yeah, uh, first I gotta see how I'm even gonna set this nonsense up. I have no idea how I'm even gonna do that. Uh, da, 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 da. because I don't even know if I'm going to equip stuff. Uh, but yeah, um, that'll be a record right there, sure. Uh, Watu, sure. Cadmus Labs guy. Team Lantern. I don't even know how to set up on this map. <laughs> And this, mm. that's the Cadmus Lab scientist? Yes, it is. Okay. Aaliyah Gregor. You know, have a, we'll actually have Dr. Claire right there, and, and then we can generate Yafet out there. And then, uh, let's see here. And then, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And uh, Yafet. Um, Finn. Claire Finn is her name. Like two, three, that last four, five, six, that seven, eight, nine, ten. The last guy. Dr. Claire, I'm going to miss her so much. I just started using her. I'm going to miss her. She rotates. Yeah, she's good. Believe it or not, Grodd was the MVP of my last game. I can bet. I can imagine. I can imagine. Yeah, he locked down Thanos and KO'd Thanos when Thanos was on last click. Uh, yeah. 
Yep, you know, I think yeah, I think we're set up. Okay, um, I'll let him know we're ready. I've always just liked the Wrecker ever since. No, it wasn't Wrecker. Um, I do like Wrecker, but uh, I always liked the Wrecking Crew, I guess, since the uh, S.H.I.E.L.D. Um, show where they had Absorbing Man in the show. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I've just always appreciated that guy. Mm -hmm. And I started playing with Invincible Iron Man, and that's when we got, there was the uh, Wrecking Crew in that set, too. It was one of the themes. Mm. Nice. Yeah, I got a feeling this is not going to be pretty, <laughs> but we shall see. Okay, I'm missing a pog. Over oh, I'm missing pile driver, the best one. You got you got KO'd for the tournament, did you know? Well, I don't know, man. Are you using the Tri Sentinel as like just a mm -hmm. Sentinel game? Is that what that is? Yeah. Right. Okay. I gotta swap these two. I'm like, how do you destroy Tri Sentinel on your sideline? I was like, oh, maybe it's Destroyer Prime. And then I'm looking no, at it. No, Sentinel's just regular Sentinel. It's like, wait, you have a Prime on your Force. That's so awkward. That's just such an awkward Prime for the team. I don't know. That's, it's cool, though. I could probably do that better. Actually, you know, I think I'll have yeah, here instead, and then just. It's fine. Yeah. I mean, it's not like I, I don't think I'm really gonna get much of a chance to quip anyway, because. Hmm. I was trying to do uh, I was trying to do interesting intros for everyone. Oh god. <laughs> the crap out of me is what you did. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, you guys start. Right. Oh, we can start? Okay. Um good luck, Lewis. Roll for gems. Uh, let's go pick time and mind. Uh, TK power gem to Thanos. Thanos will equip it. Um, boop, bop, bop, and uh, we'll call your go. Okay, Let's see, uh, TK zero ring to um, wrecker. Oops, wrecker equips it. Obviously, the blue flash is the TK flash. Uh, let's see here. Two. And like, I don't really know what to do because I know you're going to come at me. I can just hope I can survive the onslaught. It's really all I can do, which 
probably won't survive the onslaught, but we shall see. So just the two TKs. Uh, we'll go right? one, two, three, four. Excuse me. Yeah, just the two, the, the TK and the equip, right? Yep. Got it. Okay. There. And then uh, sidestep. Sidestep. Equip to molecule man. Okay. It's one, two, three cost of actions. Sidestep Cadmus guy up. Sidestep Molecule Man back, carrying Yafit. Sidestep Teen Lantern back. See Leah Gregor. Kind of important. And I think I know what's going to happen, so we'll just. Oh, I might have to borrow some smoke. Yeah. I should have them up there. Yeah, now you're good. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and smoke her. Back, well, shit, yeah, I'm not gonna be able to smoke. Um, to back, I should probably... Is there already sidestep the Cadmus guy? Uh, so you might have stepped by sidestep the Cadmus guy back there from when... Uh, That's fine. From when I had him here. Yeah, whatever you need yeah, to do. Sorry. Back there. Sorry. Four, five, yeah, just one, two. I really don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just kind of doing things. So I have a feeling. Two, three, four. And eh, sidestep Leah Gregor back. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, roll to convert. Probably not going to be much. Hey, all six of them. Okay. okay, so that's all. Yeah, I'll just I'll go. I'll, I'll, ch I'll change it later. Just save time, yeah. and we'll just put a free barrier with uh, Wrecker there. Okay. Uh, Teen Lantern could put her free barrier, but she won't. And uh, you know, we'll just go. Uh, this this flash will wild card the Masters of Evil. This flash will wild card Green Lantern, and then we're just gonna yeah put all our barriers up, and they'll be turned. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and roll for willpower and uh, gems. Um, we're gonna have to choose, um, space, time, and mind. Mm -hmm. And, um, then we'll go ahead and roll leadership with, um, the guy, uh, High Evo. No. Um, yep. so we are going to need to, uh, TK... Here, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then we will boop mm -hmm. Faust, one, two, three, four, and then move him to here. Let me just, uh, because that all stays the same, I can get to there, but then I can't get to there. Do I move up that close? Yeah, probably I do. Do um, side sidestep place to there, and then we go eight. So I want to be able to go. Anything else needs to go to there, and then we can just place the thing underneath. All right, so we'll free phase to there, carrying Faust to there. Let's make sure I got this right. Sidestep to there, place him there, then we'll go up to 11. Okay. Um, and then is that the TK flash there? Is this one the TK yeah, flash? The blue one is the TK flash. Okay, so... The blue one is TK. Sorry, I need to go there then I need to get the outwit line on the on that guy. Um Alright, so space time mine. 
We're just going to have to go without... Oh, he could just move himself and do it. That's fine. He doesn't have to be carried. Because I've got the actions before, so... Alright, so, bop. Um, so let's outwit uh, senses here. On the flash. Um, mm -hmm. And then two... Oh, the threat assessment is weird. So, um, Wrecker, we kind of want to clap. Uh, or do we outwit the Wrecker's invuln? And he does have impervious. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, let's see if we... I guess, we, yeah, we'll probably, we'll just outwit the invuln on Wrecker. Okay. Um, and, um, we will, we'll dual target, um, the Wrecker and the Flash. The, uh, this flash with, uh, actually we'll shoot, um, we're, mm -hmm. just, we're just going to shoot the wrecker. Just the wrecker. Okay. Okay. 14 for 6, so. Okay. Uh, would you like to use your prob at all? Mm, no, I'm not going to risk it. Okay. So we'll put him on to stop click. And um, then we will dual target. Uh, we'll dual target mind control, wrecker, and um, the the Lex. Okay. And I'm gonna prob that with Faust. Okay. Um, still hits them both. So we'll go Lex on to... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay. We'll go Lex on to Teen Lantern. Okay. Would you like to prob that? Mm, I think I'm okay with that. Missing. <laughs> okay. Um... Yeah, it's fine. So then I'll go Wrecker on to um, Wrecker on to um, the TK Flash. Okay. I'm okay wow. with that. I'm okay uh, with that too. Hmm. Yeah, I have to try and prob that. <laughs> it's with probably not going to work though. Prob it uh, with TK uh, Flash. the TK Flash? Okay, you yeah, may not try to. One. Nope. Yep, yeah, so then he's going to die. And, and then Lex dies. <laughs> and Flash takes one damage. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. I... How does that even happen, Lewis? Um, how do I win, lose map on a plus three? <laughs> Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so we'll go ahead and go um, with my fourth action. One, two, three, four, five, six. And um, go ahead and drop my smoke. So we'll start one. Two. Three. Four, five, uh, six, and uh, roll to convert five of them. Um, one, two, three, four. And High Evolutionary will double perplex up Chip's defense, and I'll call your go. 
Okay. Okay, so we go leadership with the flash. He gets it. I guess take a token on TK flash. And we'll go leadership with Aaliyah Gregor. And Molecule Man Cosmic Energy. No. So, eh, a few, th well, there's a few fun things we could do here. Maybe we're just basically just doing things for grins at this point. Uh, let me see, I would sidestep there. And try and convert stuff. Energy explosion, why not? That would be fun, although Faust takes three clicks to KO, so. And then Thanos would take no damage because he gets his penetrating. Eh, that would be f hilarious, but mm, nah. I guess we just maybe we just try and KO Molecule Man and uh, good old Squirrely Squirrel, just so we can score some points and at least have a respectable score. Uh, all right. So here's what we do. We Definitely have to sidestep there. Yep. Okay, so same thing. Uh, well, he still has my. He still has Masters of Evil copied, even though. Uh, yeah, that's right. He still has that. Yeah, that's correct. Absolutely. And then it, yeah, then, and he and he said he has a Green Lantern. That's right. So we're gonna sidestep Molecule Man. Uh, then. Well, let me see, because no, I have to sidestep there first. Uh, actually, we'll sidestep Molecule Man there. That's yeah, better, because now. We can do, you know, Leah Gregor doesn't really matter anymore because they have no more pogs except Yafit, although for all the good he does. We're in a sidestep Teen Lantern carrying Yafit. Uh, see, can we do that better? Yeah, we can sidestep her there. Yeah, that's better. Carrying Yafit and the Cadmus Labs guy. Okay. Uh, and I put Molecule Man in the way because I am a genius. Okay, so Molecule Man's just gonna have to walk himself out of the way. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think he has seven speed or seven, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, he has seven speed. Yeah. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Doesn't really matter at this point. Because uh, she sidestep one, two, three, four, five, six. Boom, boom. And then I can go one, two, three, four, five, six. No, okay, I cannot. Let's see, one, two, three, four, six. Man. What's funny is one, uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah, that, that'll be good enough, I guess. Okay. Uh, let's TK the Flash, because I think it's, it's, it's May place, right? After resolutions with the, with the yeah. I don't think you have to place. No, it's May you, place. Okay, yeah, we'll TK the Flash. Anyways. So, yeah. So TK to there. It's going to be second costed action. Third costed will be Teen Lantern moving. Squad here carrying TK Flash. Uh, you can sidestep the TK Flash. Well, TK Flash. It, yeah, yeah. TK Flash hasn't sidestepped. Yeah, but uh, sidestep up to TK Flash now, and then this charge Flash is going to charge carrying the squad. One, two, three, four, five. Oops, six, seven. See, we'll drop here, drop here, drop here, drop there. Uh, Masters of Evil, minus one on Molecule Man, 12 on a 17. Yep. That's just enough. Uh, okay, you got him. Okay. And then second charge, carrying the squad. There, I think I'm out of Faust range now. Yeah, you are. Yeah. Okay. And punching the squirrely, squirrely squirrel. Okay, he is a uh, he is a twenty base minus one, so he'd be a nineteen. The plus so two no, reflects from high evo. Barely. 
Um, I will prob it yep. with. Uh, so that would bear. Hit. All right, and now Cadmus Lab. Uh, that would Cadmus still hit, power, I think. Right. Yep. Yes. Okay. So we do four. Yep. You got him. Okay, and I guess the last thing we do is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I mean, it's not going to matter because you have. Uh, I guess we just kind of. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm just glad I got some points. It's not gonna matter, but I'm just doing random fine, crap now. And then roll to convert, and that's gonna and that's gonna be my and that's gonna be my turn. Okay. It's all about practice, Lewis. So yep, yep. sometimes things don't go well, sometimes they go extremely terribly when you your opponent crit yep. back to back with your own characters. Um, yep, <laughs> that was that's pretty hilarious. I have to admit. Um, let's go ahead and um, roll willpower on Thanos and gems on Thanos. Uh, so let's just do uh, time, mine, uh, space. And do I even need to move? I do need to move. Nope, I don't need to move. So, uh, these are kind of fuddy duddies up here. Um, well, you know what? I do need the time. So, let's just go ahead and free phase one, <laughs> two, three, four, five, six. Um, and. Um, We'll go ahead and double perplex up, uh, high evil double perplex up his own tack, and he'll shoot the charge flash with precision strike. Okay. Okay. And we'll see. Hold on. And then let's go one, two, three, four. Let's preboot Faust first. Um, mm hmm. And then 13 on 18. I should have put two. See if I was smart, I'll put two instead. <laughs> So that's a potential. Mm, it's, I guess. Uh, potentially. He does have. Yeah, let's try and prob. Let's, let's try. And, I know. Let's let's try and prob a T lantern. Okay. Nope. Okay, I guess we'll try and prob with the TK flash. Uh, you may. Yep. Well, that's it's not going to. One of your theme probs? Uh, well, yeah. Yeah, let's try and use it with the. <laughs> Charge flash. Okay, so Sorry. he's dead. Uh, Team Lantern takes a click of damage. Yeah. And we'll call out Grod. And Grod will leap climb Quake. Hitting 18s. Mm. You have a... Yep, that KOs here. That KOs her. Uh, oh yeah, well he has shape change. Excuse me. And sense. So the office shape changes out of it, and two damage would not be enough to KO the Cadmus Labs to be on last click. Okay. So that is. So, but that would be enough to KO here. Here. Second hit of the turn. One, two, three, four. Um, one, two, three, four. Um, let's see. One, two, three, four. I'm just seeing if there's anywhere I can get Molecule Man 2 to... One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. No, I can't even... I don't want to... I can't shoot a Watt 2, so... Um... Hey, Brandon, what um, did uh, I don't even I don't I don't think I don't think I have any, I don't think I can have anyone that can even damage you anymore. No one can even damage anyone because he has one, she has zero damage. Aaliyah Gregor, I think, has one. Watu has zero. Yapet has zero. Yeah, yeah. Well, Molecule Man can still potentially deal with damage. That's about it. What was your question, though? Um, the obscuring terrain. Did it just become hindering terrain? <laughs> Pretty did much, it? yeah. Okay, it, it just it did become hindering. Yeah, I mean it's not like nothing. Okay. 
That's what I, 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 I guess didn't know. Nothing, I, was asking. I mean, yeah, I mean, I would just yeah, just play it as hindering. I I don't really have any further details on that. Okay, that's fine. Um, so all right, so that was two actions. Uh, let's go ahead and just mind control molecule man. Um. That'll be my third hit. So let's just move him up to here. Um, actually, we'll move him to there. Uh, third hit of the turn. We'll just... Yeah, it doesn't matter because the 11's better than the 10. We'll just call out Lex. And Lex will go 11 on an 18. Mm hmm um, okay, and then Grodd will roll for Gorilla City and deal a penetrating damage to the guy and yap it. So, yeah, I think I'm I'm okay with calling it there. Okay. Uh, Sorry, Lewis. Point, unless you want, unless you want to continue, unless you want to continue. I mean, no, I have no one else to do any damage. I don't, I, I don't ever like to propose that because I don't want anybody to be offended. So. How did record? How did record die in a turn? So I mind controlled. Yeah. Uh, so he, he shot turn. for six. Yeah, I shot his uh, record to stop click. And oh, you just oh, you, did you outwit him or something? Yeah, outwitted his invuln, shot him to stop, and then I mind controlled his lex and his wrecker. Uh, crit missed with his lex, and then crit missed with his wrecker. He went to prob it, and I rolled a six on his um, um, flash. With Faust. Um, it was yeah, it's like a series of unfortunate events. It was. It was. Yeah. 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 Was unfortunate. Very unfortunate. So. Just can't let can't let record get outwitted on freaking turn one, <laughs> or turn two. Right. Yeah, I did have to roll two gems on that turn. Um, preferably two gems, and I ended up rolling for three of them. So, because I needed yeah. the space and mind, um, but I rolled space and I got all three space, time, and mind. So, so. I don't think anyone else can go three and zero with nine hundred points. We're not yeah, going to. Do, we're not doing know. four tonight, right, Brandon? We're just doing the three. I believe we're just doing the. As far as I know, let me look at. Can you? Can you? Can you grab Joe? Can you grab Azra so we can confirm? I think I might still have enough. I think I might have enough points for second or third place. Yeah, I'm just, I just, yeah. Maybe. Let's, let's have him grab Azrath real quick, just, because I'd like to just go to bed. To be honest, I would just, I just want to go sleep. My little man's been waking up at six o'clock in the morning, so. So yeah, like every scenario I played in my head against a Thanos team, um, Losing map, I'm just like, yeah, it's a lot has to go right to have a chance with this particular team. Yeah. Well, I mean, Thanos, I mean, he does, he does. Um, if you lose map, yeah. Yeah, it's. He can't let. He can't. Let well, it's because the, the power gem. Power. The, the power gem. The power gem is the difference in this team. On this team, if you don't have the power gem, which not every Thanos team has the power gem, it's a little different. Well, being hit, the power gem made a big difference. Yeah, hitting record straight through for six, so it's like, okay, yeah, I'm gonna go for that. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. Hey, as we're not doing a round four, right? Nope. No. And okay, so that's all I need. And then the, the points, right? There's no one else that has that had six hundred going into this round, right? Nope. Yeah, you're definitely first place then. Okay. You're you're three and oh nine hundred. You're good. Okay. Sorry, I just. No. Yeah, you're fine. 
Yeah. You're, you're good, man. So, uh, as I was saying, so Jack, little man. So Jack, how many? So... What were you saying, Lewis? Sorry. No, no, no. It a, Dan was about to say something. Oh, I'm just going to say good night. I'm ready to go to bed. Little man has been waking up at 6 o'clock in the morning. So, y'all yeah, no have, problem. Y'all have a great night. Thanks. Have a good one, man. Have a good night, Dan. Thanks for the games. All right. Hey, thanks everybody for watching the uh, stream tonight and uh, have a great evening.